Hey, a pleasant good day, everybody. This is Sports Fanatic News. I'm Joe Borg, a.k.a. Pro Joe. And please like, comment, and subscribe. And also, Philly Sports Guy 28 if you would like to donate to the Catch App to keep this fine program going. We really appreciate it, as well as check out our fine website, steelflyers.com. Let's get right into the Super Bowl. Big storylines in this one. You got the GOAT Tom Brady against who's probably the new GOAT, not probably, who is definitely the new GOAT in Patrick Mahomes. Uh, this is going to be a hell of a game. I think the Chiefs um, are going to be the ones that prevail. This is just going to be a quick couple-minute video. going to try to keep it under three minutes, so it's a nice, snappy, quick one for you all. But I think Brady has a 40-12. and 12, Really did great down the stretch. Um, obviously, he's going to have to score more. He can't have a rams ass Super Bowl against the Chiefs. You're going to get killed. Um, I just personally believe the Chiefs are going to um, are going to be the more consistent team throughout the game. As Ronald Jones almost hit a thousand yards. Hilaire's a great running back to watch. You got a great um, running back matchup. With Jones and Hilaire, it hasn't been talked about as much as a quarterback matchup, but that's an elite matchup as well. Then you got Evans in the receiving core. If Brown is uh, fully active, you got Antonio, uh, Godwin, a uh, great storyline with his family. If you didn't see that interview, you should probably go check that out. Um, Travis Kelsey on the Chiefs. Uh, the list goes on. Tyreek, the Baller Hill. Uh, you, got, you got a bunch of uh, people that really, really, really are the elite of the elite. Uh, in the NFL here. Um, then you got the first place team in yardage in the Kansas City Chiefs. I mean, 425.3 yards a game. That's ridiculous. 303.4 passing yards a game to the second passing offense of 289.1 of the Bucks. I think this is definitely going to be a fun, exciting offensive Super Bowl, even though these two defenses ain't shabby at all. Ninth rank for the Bucks in total yards. They suck in passing, though, which is going to hurt them. They're 21st in passing yards. That's what's going to, in my opinion, kill them against the Chiefs. Patrick Mahomes is going to torch you with that, where the Chiefs are 14, still in the top 14 in passing um, defense. And I personally believe because the Chiefs take the icing on the cake by a bit defensively and are the better offense, that with the Patrick Mahomes effect is going to prevail. Now, you can never count out Tom Brady. Um, if you keep him in the game, if you keep him close, he's the clutchest of the clutch. So, uh, he really is the Mr. Clutch, and Patrick Mahomes is his heiress. Um, so, that's really what it is for Brady. If you keep him close, he'll find a way to win the ball game. But as long as the Chiefs play their game... They play their offense well, as they always do, and have a more consistent defense than the Bucks. And the Bucks could be losing some guys, missing some guys, if they don't test, uh, or excuse me, if they don't, if they aren't healthy um, by Sunday as well. So that will not benefit them at all. I personally believe the Chiefs are going to take this game 35-21, to 21, which I think would just put you under the total. Um... But I would say with how close that is, probably not the safest bet to bet the total. But I think this will be a fun, exciting, extravagant, very nice Super Bowl that also has hockey leading up to it, the great sport of hockey this year because of the condensed seasons. You get to watch all the hockey, and then you get to watch the Super Bowl. I mean, what could be better? So everyone have a great, safe, and pleasant day. This has been the Sports Fanatic News quick four-minute and some change preview to the Super Bowl. Please like, comment, and subscribe. We hit the 100 subscribers before the goal of next week. I really appreciate that. Let's try to get to 105 now by the start of next week, everyone. So please subscribe, please like, and please donate to Philly Sports Guy 28 if you would like to help the cause to keep this fine program and make it more technologically savvy once I have more funds possibly. Have a great, safe, and pleasant day, everyone. This is Sports Fan News for Professor. I'm Professor Joe, a.k.a. Joe Borer. Peace out, everybody, and enjoy the Super Bowl.